we are going to tackle the challenge of compressing a hefty 82.6 megabytes 231 page PDF with images using 28 different PDF compressors. The first 14 were successful in compressing my file for free, while the remaining 14 failed either because of the file upload limit, because they required a payment, or they just didn't work. There were two PDF compressors that tied for the first place. I have never heard of other PDF, but this was a fantastic compressor. You didn't need to create an account and it was completely free. I have timed all the compressors for the time it took to upload my file and how long it took to compress it. Other PDF's total time to upload and compress was an impressive 90 seconds. It has four different compression levels that you can choose from starting at low to very high compression. Tip for you, if you need to compress your file a lot, try the highest level first and if the result is blurry, go back and lower the compression level. This applies to all the compressors. My 82.6 megabyte file was reduced to 4.1 megabytes. Note that the sizes are not exactly what is listed in the tool. One primary reason for the difference is the type of compression and encoding done on each website when it is processing your files. For consistency, I will be listing the size of the files as they are on my computer. Other PDF produced text quality that was indistinguishable from the original and the image quality was also very good. PDF24 Tools is another PDF compressor that I have never heard of and it tied for the first place. It was free to use and you don't need to create an account. It was one of the fastest from our list with an upload and compression in 34 seconds. It offers three options to compress your PDF. You can lower the DPI dots per inch. You can also reduce the image quality with a percentage, which is a little confusing, but the smaller the value is, it is what the image will be set at. So 25% means your image will be set at 25% of the original, not reduced by 25%. Hence the confusion. And finally, you can remove colors from your file and set it to gray. My file was reduced to an impressive 5.4 megabytes. The text quality was excellent and the image quality was also very good. The third best free PDF compressor was I Love PDF. I love the name. It is free to use and you don't need to create an account. It was much slower than our first place winners as it took over three minutes to complete the upload and compression but the file was reduced by over 94% to 5 megabytes, which is one of the primary factors of selecting best compressor, size and quality. I actually tried two compression levels, extreme and the recommended. Extreme compression reduced my file to 2.3 megabyte, but it was very blurry, so I rerun it at the recommended level. And I'm glad I did, because the text and image quality were both very good. Fourth in our list is PDF Compressor, which was free to use and I didn't have to create an account. It was second fastest at 32 seconds from all the compressors tested, but it didn't offer any options to choose your compression levels. However, in this case, both the text and image quality were excellent and the size was pretty small at 5.9 megabytes. Similar to our previous compressor, PDF.io, didn't offer any compression options, but the default settings reduced our PDF file to 5.7 megabytes in 1 minute and 18 seconds. The tool is free to use without needing to create an account. The text quality was excellent and image quality was good. The sixth compressor in our list, Zodo, was free to use without creating an account, but it was limited to the number of times you could compress a file. The only free option to compress your file was low compression, which reduced our file to 8.4 megabytes in 1 minute and 19 seconds. The quality of the text and image was both very good. Free PDF Converter comes very closely behind Zodo in 7th place. It is free to use and you don't need to set up an account. However, you are limited to one file per hour. 
It is a fast converter taking less than a minute to upload and compress my file. There are only two free options to compress though, better quality or better compression. There is a custom option that requires a paid plan. My file was reduced to a super small size of 4 megabytes, which was in the top 3 in this result, and also with great text quality and slightly blurry images. In our 8th place is the mother of PDF, Adobe, with its free Acrobat compression tool, which few people know about. You can use it for free, but you do need to have an account. I tested two options, the high and medium compression. The high compression resulted in very small file size at 3.2 megabytes, but the images in the file were very blurry. The medium option took 1 minute and 42 seconds and produced very good text and image quality, but we increased our file size to 10.1 megabytes, so a bit large. Docfly is our ninth compressor that is free and doesn't require you to create an account. However, the number of experts you can get for free is limited to 3 credits. It is a slower tool, took over 2 minutes for the process to finish, and the strongest compression still produced a very large file of 11.9 megabytes. The text and image quality was great, but it is not sufficient since the main factor why people use compressors is to reduce the file size. Zone PDF Compressor is free to use without needing to create an account, but it was very slow. It took almost 5 minutes to upload and compress my large file. There are 3 compression options, best, average and low. I chose best compression which reduced our file to 6.3 megabytes. The quality of text was great as that has been pretty much the case for all of our compressors, but the image was slightly blurry. If you have time, like over 8 minutes per file, you may want to use PDF to go. It is free to use without creating an account, but it was the slowest from all the compressors tested. It did have the most compression options, from the standard ones like basic and strong compression to insane, minimum, ebook, etc. You could also grayscale or remove images from your PDF, which is a very useful feature. I first tried the strong compression which resulted in 2.4 megabyte file size but it was very blurry, so I opted for basic compression which is a good compromise that resulted in a compact size of 5.7 megabytes with very good text and good image quality. Tiny Wow is a free compressor that doesn't require you to create an account but it was rather slow. It took over 4 minutes to upload and compress our file, although the compressed file was a decent 6.5 megabytes. However, the tool doesn't have any compression options, so the default result is the best that you can get. And even though the compressed text quality was very good, the images were a bit blurry. Coming in 13 in our list, like PDF, which is a good PDF compressor if you only need to compress text. It is free to use, but it does require you to create an account. It was fast and the entire process took a minute and 10 seconds to complete, and the file size was an impressive 2.5 megabytes. However, there is only one default compression option, and even though the text quality was great, the images were blurry. The last compressor that successfully compressed our 82.6 megabyte PDF file for free was 11 zone. It was the fastest from the 14 that were successful, but the results were not very useful. You can specify a custom compression level, but even at 50% compression, the file resulted in large size of 13.5 megabytes with blurry text and very blurry images. If you lessen the compression, that will mean your file size will be larger, which is not helpful. Now we are moving to the 14 compressors that were not able to compress our large PDF file for free for varied reasons. 10 PDF compressors failed because our file size of 82.6 MB was above the maximum allowed limit. In this category, we have PDF Converter and DocPub both with 50 MB file limit, FormSwift with 29 MB file size limit, PDF Filer and DocHub, 
both with 25 megabyte PDF size limit. PDF Simple and Wondershare had a maximum of 20 megabyte size limit. Sage allowed free compressions up to 200 pages, PDF Escape had a limit of 10 megabytes and up to 100 pages, and Working Tool had a maximum limit of only 2 megabytes. At the time of testing, small PDF required an account and subscription to compress my file, but when I checked today, it did allow a pro download for free every 12 hours. Finally, compress to go looked exactly like PDF to go, but required a subscription to compress a file. Foxit produced no compression, even though I tried it multiple times. And PDF Candy kept giving me errors. Thanks so much for watching.